I know it's, uh, it's been out there, but you're the Corrections Secretary. Any luck uh, getting uh, Governor Walker to visit his first prison ever in the state of Wisconsin as governor? Governor Walker... I mean, it is $2.5 $2. uh, billion. Governor dollars. Walker has entrusted us with trying to develop programs and the type of, uh, the type of changes to impact change. In an ongoing uh, dialogue with him on an ongoing basis, we have had that type of communication. Visiting or not visiting is not the question. It's his oversight. And his oversight with myself and our staff has been integrated, it's been connected, and it's been well, well communicated. And, I, and I'll leave it go at that. Can you speak to me about OWI and the influx um, of individuals that you've had um, uh, related to OWI cases and where that puts you with your overpopulation and with law changes, what you anticipate that that will do to your, um, your number of people that you have incarcerated as well as um, based on the governor underdoing your number by more than a thousand. I will concur with you that the numbers that are still waiting are large. Outrageous. But, but, but the fact of the matter is by, by expanding our, our treatment uh, capabilities is going to dramatically reduce those, and I think we'll deal with the needs of Act 371. Well, I will tell you, um, I want to join the chair with you on the telemedicine piece. It is something that I know that I've already spoke with some communication companies that are doing work in other portions of the, of the nation around telemedicine and so and they help with equipment so yeah. maybe we might be able to marry those things equipment together. is quite honestly right now equipment is the key i equipment know equipment is the key make a note me and nigrin are talking about working on something together <laughs> um body cameras well, what about me well yes secretary you too <laughs> <laughs> okay okay <laughs>